We are here today to introduce you to the digital offers and services of Frankfurter Buchmesse. We aim at giving you full information on our digital platform and how you can make your participation a success. This year has been challenging for all of us, so we are very happy to say that Frankfurter Buchmesse is taking place. It's a special edition and we are very much looking forward to it. Frankfurter Buchmesse leads the way in activating global network and opening up future markets. That will be truer than ever in 2020, the year of the pandemic. We want to promote an exchange of experience, facilitate contacts, share successes and identify trends. This session is presented to you by my colleague Birgit. There she is. Birgit, do you want to say um, some words about yourself? Yes, of course. Hello to everybody. Very nice to meet you here on that platform. My name is Birgit Fricke. I'm working for the Frankfurt Book Fair now for 20 years, which is a long time. And I'm now in charge of children's books, the tourism section and cosplay at the weekend. Thank you, Birgit. So this is me. Um, I'm Beatrice and I've been with the fair for seven years now. I'm currently the key account manager for visual culture which also includes uh, the Arts Plus. Some of you might be familiar with this format already. In normal years at this time, I'd be busy talking to exhibitors about their stand design, about shipping their goods to Frankfurt, about accessing the fairgrounds and so on and so on. This year, everything is different. Um, we are planning a fully digital fair, which comes with a whole new set of challenges and learnings. We are all looking forward to this. Let me just do, before we start the presentation, some housekeeping rules. If you, ha if you do have questions, you're most welcome to, uh, to ask them in, in written form, please. You have on your dashboard, on your Zoom dashboard, you have a button that says Q&A in English, questions and answers. It might be in your regional language. Um, so please do enter all your questions um, uh, there. And, uh, and they will we'll collect them up at the end of our presentation, which will last for between 20 and 25 minutes. And we try to answer as many questions as we can. In case we are running out of time and there's no uh, time to answer your questions, you can contact, of course, your um, sales manager at the fair or also our service center. Um, you find the contact details on, on our website at the bottom of the website. There's the, you have the contact details of our service center. So I'll start the presentation right now. So let's see. Um, there we go. Just a second. Um, no. There we are. So I'll let you start, Birgit. Yes, I will. <laughs> well. The motto this year is all together now and um, we all together can make the fair to the, the event in October. We all need you and um, I hope and I'm sure we have the right offers for you to make your business a success this year with the, Frank with the, Frank with the Frankfurter Buchmesse. Mm -hmm. So how to present your company to an international audience? You have a lot of options. The very first one is to be a digital exhibitor and to promote your events via our calendar of events or advertising tiles. You can take part in Frankfurt rights. You can do your rights business. Um, just um, Enter the name of the person in charge of rights in your company at your registration form and there you will have a portal and you can do your rights business at Frankfurt Rights this year as you did at the Frankfurt Book Fair. We have matchmaking opportunities in different ways. One, one is our matchmaking tool via the app or the desktop which is new this year and a lot of programs. I will tell you more details later also about our live program, the Bookfest City and the Bookfest Digital, which is a completely new thing we do this year. Well, seven steps to success. This is a lie. It starts with step zero. 
Step zero is taking the time for the Frankfurt Book Fair, as you did for the physical fair, because you need time to explore all our options, to search in the catalog, to get in contact, to, to use our matchmaking tools. But of course, first of all, is becoming a digital exhibitor, to set up a My Book Fair account, to get also in the matchmakings and programs, create your corporate profile to be found by your customers, showcase your events, include your titles in Frankfurt Rights and network around the globe. And join, of course, the conversation about current industry, industry trends and developments. So we'll look at uh, these seven steps uh, more in detail right now. I'll start with um, step one, quite obvious, um, uh, still considering that it's step zero, as um, Birgit mentioned, really take your time and it, it does take time to register, to, um, to take part in the events, to make new contacts. So first of all, you become a digital exhibitor. If you were already registered as a regular um, exhibitor at Frankfurt Book Fair, um, you, you're, you become uh, automatically a digital exhibitor. If you're still new, and if you're new this year and you haven't registered, that's where the form is. You have the URL that's on the slide here. It's quite, it's very simple, straightforward. You fill out um, a, a form, you send it back to us, and within a couple of days, um, you have your, you, you get your confirmation and um, you receive um, all the, all the, in, the information that you need in order to um, fill out your your profile and do the next steps. Actually, step two, there it is, the next step. May I interrupt, Beatrice? Please hurry, because the deadline will be the end, end of this week. So please hurry and fill in the registration form for digital exhibitors to take part in all the ways you can at the Frankfurt Book Fair. Sorry, Beatrice. No, no, don't be sorry. You're right to say that. So registration deadline is uh, September 30th. We now have almost 3,000 exhibitors. So please, really come and join the crowd. It's going to be super interesting with a lot, a lot of people attending. So step two is, um, uh, is uh, setting up uh, a login that uh, actually allows you to enter uh, almost all our catalogs and also our event. It's called My Book Fair Account. For those who participated in previous years, um, you might already have it. There is a person uh, that's indicated on the registration form that you indicate and you appoint um, who can, um, who actually is in charge of the corporate profile, of the company profile, um, but all the others, uh, colleagues, uh, other colleagues in your company can also set up a personal profile and they'll need it in order to join our event uh, live or the networking formats or uh, other platforms. So that is really um, needed for everybody who wants to, um, to, um, to, uh, to participate. So this really expands your coverage um, worldwide, it increases, of course, visibility and generates new uh, business leads. So as I said, the person who um, has the, the account uh, and is in charge of the corporate profile um, should, should, um, should design and set up uh, the exhibitor's direct uh, listing. So that can be done um, on the, uh, through the link that you have on, on your screen here. Uh, this year um, it has uh, uh, free additional services, so you actually have the possibility to add much more information and also visuals to your company profile um, yeah. that really makes it a kind of a comprehensive um, a showcase of, of, of your company and the offerings um, of your company. This can be done um, through this link here. Well, and of course you can showcase your event. I just got a message that the YouTube stream does not work. For the ones maybe waiting and listening to us, we will record this uh, event and we will have it on our YouTube channel later on. So we are very sorry for the inconvenience. But we go on with the calendar of events. There you can upload links to whatever you like. It can be a YouTube video, it can be pre-recorded content, and uh, please use this to promote your company also with all the content and events you would like to present. 
The second option to showcase your events, but of course many other things you would like to present are our advertising tiles. There's one part, Reader Delights, which is dedicated to B2C content, and the other part is Business Insights. You can book an advertising tile. Advertising tiles are not limited. You can book as many tiles as you want. Upload a picture you like, a link, and a description what the link is leading to. So maybe um, I can add here, this, there's two, um, two, let's say, target audiences you can, you can actually reach out to. So there's one um, that's more uh, directed to the general public, to the readership. Um, it's called Reader's Delights, and it includes um, a lot of topics that, you know, that are very, very um, well known at Frankfurt Book Fair. So it would be like audio, it's kids, it's romance, it's uh, science fiction. Birgit, am I missing out some of them? No, and business insights, uh, there you will find things you might already know, like Frankfurt Kids, Frankfurt New Generation, Frankfurt Edu, and Frankfurt Audio, and many other options you have to advertise your tile there. Now, how, how can I get access to the desired tools? You, you just log in at my book fair, you go to the tile for exhibitors and there you will find all options you have as a digital exhibitor. The exhibitor directory, you can submit advertising tiles, of course the calendar of events, Frankfurt rights and uh, also promotion. to drink a water. I'm right back. Sorry. Um, we already mentioned that previously, so I'm going to talk about um, uh, Frankfurt Rights, which is a platform that will be launched um, October 1st. And it's a, it's a trading platform for, um, for rights. So this uh, actually requires an, a, a separate setup, so a separate account that you need to set up where you can also, uh, again, you promote your company, you can upload all the titles uh, that you have that are available for sales. You can create, you can add, embed videos of, uh, of titles you want to push and you want to put forward. Um, there's many, many um, uh, options and uh, possibilities to, um, to really um, um, put forward um, uh, what you have on offer. So there will be a separate uh, seminar similar to this one that only focuses on the Frankfurt rights and other uh, tools that are relevant for the rights community. And the seminar is taking place tomorrow, September 24th um, at 3 p.m. Uh, German time. Uh, the, you can access, you can access the, the seminar um, the same way you, you came here. So there's a Zoom link and hopefully there's going to be a live stream on, the, on YouTube. In case there's no live stream, of course, the, the video will be made, make, made available um, afterwards uh, in the recording version. So that's, um, I think I'll, I, I will not um, develop more um, Frankfurt rights here as this really is targeted for a very specific audience um, and all the techni technicalities will be explained to you um, in the seminar tomorrow. <coughs> well, okay. I Sorry, I can go on. Can go on? Okay. Yeah, so I'm just coughing a little bit. Um, so, uh, networking opportunities, that is, of course, something substantial and uh, very, very important at Frankfurt Book Fair. We want to make sure that this can also happen in the digital uh, arena this year. And we made available all sorts of tools and uh, events where this can happen, and we are very much looking forward to it. Um, I'm really excited to see how it is going to work and how it's going to be accepted the community. So one of them is um, the matchmaking tool. That's something um, that was already operational in the past years uh, through the Frankfurt Book Fair um, app that you can download on your, um, on your, um, on your smartphone, on your mobile, de mobile device. Uh, it's also quite straightforward, quite simple. You sign up uh, with my Book Fair account 
you can create a profile um, and actually a profile you can indicate what you um, what you have to offer and what you are looking for so for example if you have rights to sell uh, to a certain territory or language and you're looking to acquiring rights from another territory and um, afterwards you get matched according to the what you indicated on your profile and you can also actively search for ma uh, for matches by keywords uh, and you can send and receive um, contact requests there's even an option for um, uh, for video uh, for video calls. So it's quite simple. Um, you can contact uh, other users directly, and you can get in touch with them. It's available, as I said, through the Frankfurt Book Fair app, which I really recommend you download when when participating uh, this year at the fair. And um, you can, there's also a desktop version available this year. Um, now something. Um, Fun, hopefully, um, there should be uh, our format that we call the Hof. It of course refers to the Frankfurter Hof, which is this very iconic location you see on your right side um, in, a, in a hotel in Frankfurt, where um, the community uh, and the attendees of Frankfurt Book Fair meet in the evening for drinks and 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 meetups and you know catching up with with friends from all over the world. Uh, discussing and something sometimes breaking uh, deals. Um, so that's something we want to take also to the digital arena with um, a format uh, that allows randomized breakout sessions uh, where you can meet new people, uh, you can start discussions, and then of course you can continue afterwards in a more, uh, more formal way, uh, maybe by phone call or emailing each other. The whole uh, setting is informal, as I said, there's live music, there's some kind of animation, um, there's special guests for every session. Every session has a, addresses a certain community that can participate and that is uh, invited to join um, with special guests, like, uh, you know, like someone who is well known in, in the community who's going to say a couple of words and is going to make introductions. We have another special guest, I'm not sure we should let's say it let's say it here um it's actually the it's the barkeeper uh from the frankfurter hof who has been there for years and of course he's there every every october when when all the the crowd from Frankfurt book fair attends um the bar so i'm sure he has a lot of stories to tell and he also he also offers um a cocktail um a recipe that um everybody actually can you know can, can prepare for themselves at home so that um, is that is going to be fun. Uh, uh, other another format is curating networking sessions um, that actually focus on B two B issues and also address specific communities of people with with with, with interest with common interests and and also focuses on industry trends. Um, for all of that uh, is listed on our website. Um, again, um, it starts quite uh, soon. Actually, after tomorrow. And, September 24th um, with the first uh, kickoff session. So register um, um, and and take part and you know and start your um, Frankfurt Book Fair um, feeling uh, already tomorrow. This is um, <coughs> um, uh, uh, it's your ZIP. ZIP uh, stands for Creative Intellectual Property. That's a format we developed a couple of months ago already. Uh, the idea is and was and is still to counteract actually the loss of all the, 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 the opportunities um, um, at industry events to pitch your content and your projects to other people. This is a path platform where people can up to upload um, uh, pitch, pitches and can interact with, uh, with the viewers of the pitches. There's also live pitches, there's interviews with, with people who, who do interesting stuff. So there's a lot of things happening. It's a community of a thousand people now. Uh, still growing. We have more information um, through the, the, the link and the URL that you see on the website here. Um, please do join our community. There is also a community meetup um, at the HOF, the format I just presented um, earlier. So there's also a chance to get to meet people actually um, in real, let's say, in real digital life. Well, and in real digital life, <laughs> you can get in contact not only via our matchmaking tool, but also via our conference and 
curated trade programs. The Frankfurt Conference um, has uh, specific topics like academic and scholarly publishing, rights and licensing, publishing insights and audio. We will have curated trade programs and also there you can network in breakout sessions with the other participants and you can talk about the Arts Plus, you can talk about kids, academic authors and edu and many, many other topics which are not on this slide at the moment. But if you go to the website of the Frankfurter Buchmesse to the Digital Fair, you will find all our programs, just click on it and uh, you will find a very easy way to participate and uh, to increase your network. Well, and also, of course, we have a literary program this year for those who might travel to Frankfurt and also for those who can't come to Frankfurt. At the Festhalle at the fair, we have uh, a program at the IRD Book Fair stage. Um, it's in cooperation with the German broadcasting companies like IRD, ZDF and many others with an interesting program. So if in case you're coming to Frankfurt and you have the chance to visit the Festhalle, please, please refer to your sales manager to get the information how to buy tickets for that. Also, the opening ceremony will take, part, will take place in a physical, physical way on Tuesday, 13th October, with a keynote speech of David Grossmann. And also the same if you're coming to Frankfurt, which might be the case, so please refer to your sales manager to see if it is possible to attend. <coughs> Well, and then also for those who might come to Frankfurt, we recommend the Bookfest City with over 70 events with uh, famous authors. And uh, well, you will have a lot of fun in the evening and uh, also during the day. But those who can't come to Frankfurt, of course, can take part or have a look at our Bookfest Digital. This is a format we are presenting the first time this year and it offers readings and other events all day long from the very early morning till the late in the evening. And you will find, I think everybody will find something he or she likes. Well, and not forget to mention, uh, the package of the German government, which enables us to offer our services free of charge for you. Okay, so I think we came to um, the end of this presentation. I'll stop um, sharing it. Um, and I will look uh, in the Q&A um, section. So um, again, if, if you have questions you would like to address with us uh, directly, please do um, type them in this Q&A um, part of the screen, this little tab that you see on, on Zoom. And I will start picking up um, questions. Somebody's saying hello, hello, Mohammed. <laughs> um, So somebody is asking about um, updating the company profile. Um, she's saying that the profile has not been um, updated um, with her with the information she entered or she sent. So when will this when will this be be done? Um, if you're if you're um, submitting uh, changes in your profile, it normally is overnight that it will be online. If you have any difficulties or if something is not working, you can find the address of the company who is working on the catalog. It's uh, buchmesse at neureuter.de and also there is a telephone number in case you want to call. Okay, so that should be the exhibitors um, list uh, catalog was, uh, was made available um, in the beginning of the week. 
So yes. then in the first case, um, we know that from the past, that sometimes there is um, there are some troubles because everybody's actually accessing it on yes. the same time and the, the server gets overloaded from once in a while. So if you have trouble once, maybe you try again. And if you keep having troubles, you do contact the, the, the company who, who makes the, the, the catalog available. Or you also, again, you get in touch with your sales manager. And I wanted to say that um, here, I, I'm not sure I mentioned it before, and so your sales manager is actually always um, in copy when you receive your order confirmation. So you can see who, who, who's the email address there and you can get in touch with the person. Um, so someone is asking, is there an example of what one might look like? So now I'm not sure when this question was asked, so I don't know what it refers to. So maybe Kirsten, you can ask, the, you can, you can um, specify what you exactly mean, what looks an example of what you're, you, you mean. Um, Sorry, where do I upload videos and materials under step four events? If so, how? So that's probably how you upload uh, materials in the calendar of events. Yes. Well, like I mentioned, you log in with your My Book Fair account and you go to calendar of events and there you click on, click on calendar of events and you will be guided and uh, shown how to upload your links and your event, how to enter it in the catalog of events. But first of all is you have to log on with your My Book Fair account. Thank you, Birgit. Natasha is asking, what's a virtual stand? How does it look like? Well, <laughs> we very often had that question. Well, it's a 3D stand, which will some customers of us did on their own. They had their stand builder who was not only designing a physical stand, but also a 3D virtual stand. But this is something you would have like, you would have to do on your own. If you Google virtual stands, you will find a lot of offers in the internet of companies offering to do virtual stands and 3D options. Um, so Gina Martinez is asking a similar question regarding um, my book for account for the information they uploaded. So it's usually um, when you upload an information, it is published the next day. Yes. So now there's a question from the Catalan Literary Foundation. If we do not sell rights, but we are a public institution and we usually attend with a stand, what options do we have? Well, you can register as digital exhibitor you can have a cat catalog entry you can um well you can uh, promote all the events you would like to do or you can promote everything you would like to promote via our advertising tiles exactly so if, for example if you would like to promote um, um uh, catalan authors you can uh, you can um, set up um events, um, virtual events that you would in, uh, include in, in our calendar of events. As Birgit said, if you want to promote certain again, certain authors or a kind of literature, you can book our advertising tiles. And by uh, being a, 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 digital, um, a digital exhibitor, of course, you have visibility for your own institution where you can also get a lot of information about what you do, where we can find you, how, you, how people can contact you. And please, uh, um, all of you, should have on my book fair account to attend our matchmaking and networking programs. So I think this part also is very important uh, for this year's fair to really take, take part in all the offers we have. Exactly. So we have again a question with regards to the, to the virtual stand. I think um, Birgit, she already uh, mentioned, um, mentioned that. When can I start uploading titles? I think this refers to Frankfurt rights. And did you say this requires a separate account login? Well, that's, yeah, you are right. Um, the Frankfurt rights will be available from 1st of October. And um, if you're registering as a digital exhibitor, enter the name of the person in charge of um, rights in your company and this will be transmitted to Frankfurt Rights and there will, you will have a, a second account to enter your titles. But tomorrow at three in the afternoon, if I'm right, there's uh, 
seminar about how to do Frankfurt Rights, which will provide much more information as we are able to provide in that uh, info session. Thank you, Birgit. So Bob is asking, can I ask what the mood picture is, please? I'm, I'm not sure where, where this was mentioned in the presentation. Do you remember that, Birgit? No. I'm not sure about that as well. I'm sorry. That's probably something um, that goes with the advertising tiles. Yes, yes. Um, so how how to add book titles? Is it only available under right? If you want to sell rights, of course, you should you, you should use Frankfurt rights. If you want only to promote your titles to customers without selling uh, rights, you can do that via registering for an uh, example, um, advertising tile if you want to promote uh, special authors or certain titles in your company. What assets can be uploaded to the advertising tiles and how are they presented to the end user? The advertising tiles are rotating. Um, if you go to our website, you will find examples of advertising tiles already. And this might give you an impression and an idea how our advertising tiles work and how they look like. I, I hope this answers your question. There was an additional question. Um, can the end user download it? No. And what happens after the file with the, with the tiles? Um, the, they will not be online any longer. This is due to our data restrictions. Um, people can't download them and they're not online for longer term, for longer terms. <clears throat> now again, um, what is the appropriate place to upload our rights catalog? Well, this is Frankfurt Rights, so please, if you register as digital exhibitor, enter the name of the person dealing with rights in your company and then it will be sent to Frankfurt Rights and you will get uh, an account at Frankfurt Rights. But please, if you're interested in doing that, take part in the event tomorrow. I think there will be a lot of questions you might have which will be answered there. Is there an example of what an advertising tile might look like? I think Birgit mentioned that already. So go on our website and you already have those tiles rotating. You see them under the different kind of tabs with the business worlds. And, you know, for example, you go to Frankfurt Kids or Frankfurt Edu, so you would have those rotating um, um, banners. Another question from Hoop van, van der Poel is, are all presentation options really free? And are they also paid advertisements? They are free. <laughs> and they are an advertisement for you, of course. Again, this is due to the, to the support we received this year from the Ministry of Culture of Germany. Thanks to this grant, we are able to make uh, the offer uh, available for free this year. So another question is referring to the digital activities. Will there be technical assistance to test the link we upload? Um, I think it's not that uh, difficult to do that. If you need technical assistance or if you have any difficulties in doing that, please refer to your sales manager to find out what the difficulties are and how to solve them. Thank you, Birgit. Hello, uh, so this is Lydia asking a question. Can you tell me please if it's okay to represent our publishing house by the catalog of books, not by separate titles? Um, well, if you want to present your publishing house, you should have one catalog entry because this is uh, compared to a physical stand. This is your stand this year, it's your catalog entry. And if you have a uh, titles you want to present, you should do that via the advertising tiles we offer. And uh, Lydia, if your question refers to Frankfurt Rights, um, again, we suggest you participate in the seminar tomorrow because then uh, they really explain how it's best for you as a publisher 
to present your titles, you know, so that you are best um, discoverable, let's say. Somebody has a question related to the to the app. Is the name of the app Frankfurt Frankfurt the Book Method 2019? Yes, I yes. Just looked it up in the in the in the app store. Yes, that's the name. Thanks for your answer. Okay, I am in contact with your service company and from, but they are. I guess it's taking a while. Yes, it does take a while. So that's again the the the, the catalog um, for for exhibitors. It's it's rush hour right now. The, the, it was just put online, so it might take a while until also the service provider answer to you. So thanks for your patience. Um, so somebody's asking where they can see the recording. So you can look uh, there. The, you can uh, see the recording on the YouTube link you received also with this invitation. So the advertising titles are they for free? Yes. And are they available in different um, prices? No price, it's for free and sizes? Uh, no, it's one size. But uh, if you go to uh, how to book an advertising tile, if you go via my, your my book fair account, uh, you can have a web form and there you will be informed uh, how and which and how and which size you have to transmit the picture, the text and everything. So um, there's again a question related to the virtual exhibition booth. Again, this is something you would have to um, organize for yourself and also find a service provider who can do that for you. Um, and there's a question again related to the tiles. If they are for money, no, they are for free. Um, it doesn't work like Google Ads or Facebook Ads. No, it's for free. They're rotating and everybody has the same amount of, of you know, um, visibility. So there's somebody joining from Bangladesh, Jopan, hello. So he has two or she has two questions. How do I submit my company rights selling catalog? How can I upload all the visual advertisement? Well, again, if you're talking about Frankfurt rights, uh, you should attend the info session tomorrow at three in, in the afternoon. And if you want to upload um, uh, materials to your um, exhibitors profile, you can also upload PDFs. So we have somebody joining from Greece. Hello. Okay, so if you really have uh, problems with like assistance when you have troubles uh, signing in or trouble seeing the information you uploaded, you really um, know something we can pick up here um, case by case. So get in touch with our service center or the service provider or our sales um, sales manager you, you've been dealing with. So someone is saying, I believe only one representative for each digital exhibitor. Yes, that's the person who's in charge of the corporate profile, but other staff from the same company can join the book fair. Yes, of course, they should all register at my book fair to attend all the, con the conference and all the sessions we offer. Uh, and again, a question related to the advertising tiles that seem to be very popular. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's nice that they are popular, we like it. <laughs> it mentions copying being in English and German. Is that required? Are, they, are, we, are we just translate the English to German and send two versions? Um, well, this is up to you. If you are booking an advertising tile at the um, English, an English advertising tile, it is automatically also shown at the German speaking website. So um, if you can translate it, you're very welcome. But uh, also you can, you can't do it, whatever you like, but everybody should know that all the tiles are automatically shown at the German speaking and English speaking website. Okay, so there's a lot of questions that are uh, similar to the ones we already um, answered. So I'm just trying, I don't want to skip, but some of the questions were already answered. So maybe if you um, listen to the, to the event again, you'll see your, um, um, so, so somebody is asking how they can embed a virtual exhibit uh, stand. Uh, so there's actually a, a link you can get in your um, profile. 
Yes, right in the exhibitors uh, directory. And if you register as a digital exhibitor and you create your profile, there's a link for virtual stands, a special link you can use. So somebody has a question related to the Hof that um, we presented. Uh, the breakout sessions, uh, is that done automatically on Zoom or do we choose who we want to talk to? This is actually a random function uh, that Zoom has. Um, so that's something we can randomize. Um, there's, there's other events, the curated networking um, adds with registration and then people are actually matched together. The Hof is really like, really like being in a bar, you don't know who you know who you have in front of you. So it's it's um it's random. So another question from the UK is a full list of digital exhibitors attendees available yet? Yes, you can have the list of digital exhibitors via the Frankfurt catalog. Um, you mentioned selling rights is this also the place to sell co-edition rights, for example, uh, for art and design books? Yes, you can actually, in Frankfurt Rights, you can specify what kind of rights um, are available. And the third question, is there a way also of showing backlist available for co-editing royalty deals? I assume, something, that's something you'll learn tomorrow in the seminar. So let me just um, look at the time. So we have three minutes left. So I'm going to go through the questions. Uh, this to be an endless uh, thread of questions. <laughs> let me just see that a lot of things we have already um, um, answered. Um, That's also some. I'm sorry. I um. <clears throat> Shall I help you, um, I think I, I just I just want to pick one last question, um, and then we'll have to stop the meeting because we are running out of time. So there's a question um related to the digital book fest. Does the digital book fest assume we digitally participate? Are watching um, online all day? Can we just go online, offline when possible and pick up information at different times of the day? Yes, of course you can. You don't have to stay all day. You can uh, find out uh, in our calendar of events uh, to which uh, events or to which, which sessions you would like to go and uh, like to watch. You don't have to stay all day long. <laughs> There's, there's several questions again uh, related to the, the name of the of the Frankfurt Book Fair app. It's Frankfurt the Buchmesse 2019, and it's downloadable. You can download it from any app store, on your mobile device. Okay, so we'll um, we'll stop here answering the questions. Um, I hope uh, we were able to give you comprehensive information about um, our digital offer. Uh, if you have more questions, um, please do contact the persons, uh, the people I already mentioned um, previously. And um, well, thanks for your time. You'll need more time to prepare for Frankfurt Book Fair. Do take the time. Um, it will be useful um, during the week of the fair. It's going to be excited, uh, exciting. Uh, the week, um, this is the week of the fair and we're gonna, going to meet in very, very different formats. So we are very much looking forward to this. We hope seeing you there on our platform and maybe later again in real life. So thank you very much. Take care of yourself, stay healthy and see you soon in Frankfurt Book Fair online. Thank you from my side as well and hope to see you all in the digital world this year. Bye-bye.